A lot of people, it's me, pretty tough, coming back at you with another one of my Ace Combat 7 Ace Guides. And on today's Ace Guide, we're going to be going over how to unlock the Ace for Operation Magic Spear. The criteria for this one is to destroy all of the missile silos in under 4 minutes. But first of all, if it's your first time here and you haven't subscribed, go and hit the subscribe button, hit the bell to be notified when I release new guides like this. So as usual, I'd like to show you the skin beforehand. It's pretty much the MiG-31B Foxhound with a mix of white and blue striping on the aircraft. So for mission 13, Bunker Buster, since speed is key here, I chose to use the F-22 Raptor since I need a fast aircraft to take them out all in quick succession. The parts I used here are typically ones for maneuverability, speed, and de-icing since it's going to be cloudy around the skies. So if you want to have a look at that and pause it and equip the same parts, feel free to do so. So when you sortie for this mission, you want to take out all the silos in less than four minutes. But just try and do it as fast as you can. Play this mission on hard, do it all in one go, because if you die or restart to a checkpoint, it will interfere with the spawning of Comet. So I'm going to go ahead and let the footage play and you can see how I did it. Don't worry if you miss a silo, you can miss them a couple of times, just make sure you get it done within four minutes. And then when Comet spawns, I will show you what to do and we will go from there.
So now that the silos have been destroyed, and you saw I've taken a couple of hits, that doesn't really matter. Once the cinematic begins where the missile comes out of the dam, and you spawn back into the gameplay area, if you look on my radar, you see an aircraft to the left of you. You need to turn and engage that aircraft and take it down as fast as you can. Because the missiles are going to reach critical altitude very quickly. Hence why I use the F-22 Raptor. So, all you need to do is go and hunt him down. You will find that this is Comet. You can see it on the targeting HUD. Big 31B, the distance, and his name, Comet. So then, race after them. Take him down, and you will have unlocked this skin. So, now he's down. You've got the skin. But as I said beforehand, any restart into a checkpoint, including the failure of a mission, will result in him not spawning, potentially. So, using this fast aircraft, you have to chase down that silo as fast as you can and take it down. Otherwise, you will fail the mission. So, as you see here, I fire my last two missiles before the game forces my aircraft down because I've reached the max altitude, finally destroyed it, and then you'll have plenty of time to go take out the other ICBMs. So then hopefully if you've done everything correctly and it's all gone well for you, during the after action report in the targets destroyed section, you will see Comet, and that's how you know you've unlocked them. And then in the next screen you may get the medal, and then it will tell you you have new skins available for that aircraft. And with that my friends, you are one step closer to getting the Bird of Prey achievement for Ace Combat 7. If you join me from the last video, we'll be hunted down three aircraft during Operation Dragon Breath, the SU-34 known as Walrus, the Mirage 2005 known as Faldre, and the A-10 Lightning, known as Buffle. If you haven't seen that, link to it in the top right. Or join me next time when we hunt down the SU-47 Burkut, known as Gadfly, during Operation Werewolf. So then my friends, that is it for this video. If you found it useful and you would like to see more like this, hit like on this video and subscribe. If you have any comments, questions or queries, put them down below and I will do my best to answer you. So then, that's it for me. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye bye.